169.2 guys. It is 747 and I am here at the university just waiting for the shuttle and very quickly as you see it is there is snow there is ice outside uh, very unusual for April I'm not sure what is going on but I definitely want this weather to go away and for spring to be in full effect but it feels like January and yeah hopefully this weather goes away but uh, pretty much weighed in this morning at 169.2 uh, it's not a new low weigh-in, but it's definitely much uh, lower than this past weekend. I know after my cheat meal, I was at 172 and was hovering in the 170s for a while. Now, what I wanted to talk about and kind of give a tip to people that are dieting, when you're in a caloric deficit for 16, 12 weeks, what happens is your body kind of gets used to it and knows what to expect. It knows that you're gonna get six meals a day. It knows that you're gonna get this amount of calories, and it kind of you become stagnant. Um, your metabolism might slow down because uh, it's thinking, okay, I'm only getting this amount of food, so I have to uh, preserve it. So it kind of plays tricks on you. So I can kind, I, you can use the metaphor that your body is like a furnace. So you know when you put. Um, fresh coal or wood it, it lights up and it burns but eventually the fire kind of like dies down and remains steady for a long period of time so if you introduce a new coal and new firewood all of a sudden lights up again and there's a big fire right so you kind of want to think about your body and your metabolism in that way um, so introducing food to the body your body all of a sudden goes like whoa what's going on I need to start burning more calories. I need to uh, speed up my metabolism and break down this food. And then all of a sudden, you still keep doing your training and the weight starts to click off. But I see the shuttle coming. So I'm gonna head out to class. I got 8 a.m. class and I'll catch you guys a little later. Hopefully you guys can use that tip and apply it into uh, your, your fitness goals. So I'll catch you guys in the next clip. What is going on guys? Rudolph reporting live. Um, no, just a lot of stress. Um, just working on some homework here. Have an exam tomorrow. Eating my red potatoes with tilapia. And I am having some of this Asahi berry. How do you say it? Akai or Asahi? Asahi berry. Mio energy in my water zero calories has some caffeine and I want to share with you guys on my channel something big something important and we're gonna do it together so I'm gonna hit proceed to checkout and yeah stay tuned guys stay tuned I'm gonna give you guys hints but um, some awesome stuff are in the works for you guys and I'll be announcing on the channel very soon so I just ordered some things that I'll be posting in the near future and so far it's been a very productive day and gonna hit legs later on today so I'll see you guys at the gym this afternoon peace currently 4 30 and we made it to the gym now like I said we're gonna work on legs today and uh, we loaded here 135 on the bar now we are gonna be doing four sets of 20 reps so in the last month of my prep for my competition, we definitely don't want to go heavy, you know, uh, sets of five, eight reps, because our body is so depleted right now. And uh, being on such a low caloric deficit and training heavy is just not a good combination. It definitely sets up, you know, a chance for injury, and that's the last thing we want going to this competition. So, uh, gonna be doing four exercise for legs, and then my steady state cardio. So most likely today I'm gonna to be doing the Stairmaster, do a little, something a little different. Um, but uh, we're gonna get after it with uh, some barbell squats. So here we go, four sets, 20 reps. Sweet. You put it on 
guys just finished with those calf raises hashtag team no calves um, but I'm working on them four sets 20 reps for every exercise you guys saw in this video and long and behold just finished sipping on my ANS BCAs and uh, we have a surprise here what's going on Josh <laughs> what up from performance nutrition <laughs> yeah guys my sponsor here ANS and Performance Nutrition. They have a demo booth at the LA Fitness in Pawtucket. So if you guys are in Rhode Island, please go check them out. They also have a store in Seekonk, Dartmouth, and I think so a total of six locations throughout New England. So they got it all, guys. Uh, and uh, now it's just time to finish cardio. So I'm going to talk to Josh a little bit, hang out, and then going to finish cardio, which is the second part of this um, training session. So I'll see you guys on the next clip. Just finished our cardio, as you can see pretty drenched and I gotta say this workout was pretty pretty good for being you know under four weeks out I uh, I did all the weight like I wanted to the only thing that was like a little bit of a problem was the calf raises I started to um, I definitely started to tighten up and that wasn't good so it was painful but definitely got through all the sets all the reps and the cardio which was great and I want to show you guys why performance nutrition in Rhode Island is the best sponsor so they gave me literally a bag full of samples I mean pre-workout protein powders aminos a nice optimum nutrition shaker bottle so a bunch of awesome goodies in there use PN 108 ANS to save 10% off on BCAAs, pre-workout, the relentless pre-workout, and any ANS supplement product. So I definitely uh, wouldn't recommend it to you guys if I don't believe in it and if it wasn't ta great tasting and uh, didn't perform to, to my expectations. So definitely guys go check that out. Like I said, I will put the website in the description box below and the discount code right now on the video so you guys can go save 10% off. And yeah guys, I'm just so freaking excited. Like Cotton candy sunset. What is going on guys? I am vlogging from my car. It is currently 724 and just finished our workout. Um, and like I was saying in the last clip, I'm just so excited. Um, I was just talking to my sponsor, Performance Nutrition, and there's so many things in place that I just want to share with you guys, and I just can't wait to to live them because they're going to be life-changing experiences. For, not for not only for me, but for this channel and for my fitness career. And I'm just so excited. I 
today's definitely a great turnaround. I know I posted up a video this morning. Um, it was episode 16, I believe. I titled it, I cheated. And it wasn't really because I cheated, but I just felt so down and without energy and it, that happens when you're working so hard when you're working so hard and you wake up every day at 6 a.m. and you apply yourself to a goal and your discipline and you don't get you don't let anything get in the way of your hard work after a while you know it it adds up and it builds up and we're all human and I just want to share with you guys that you know realness um, that I am human and you get tired sometimes and it's hard to stay motivated but like I've always said on this channel uh, not every day you're gonna be motivated but you still got to get the work done because the days that you're unmotivated every when you're motivated it's great it's great to go to the gym it's great to work on your goals it's great to to put in 18 20 hour days of work it's great you're motivated you have a big smile on your face, everything is going great. But the days that you're unmotivated, those are the most important because if you just say, no, I'm gonna hide underneath my bed sheets today. I'm not gonna go outside. I'm not gonna do what I said I was gonna do. Guess what? You know, that's a day that you can't get back and that's a day that you're gonna look back one day and be like, wow, I let myself down. And no guys, we're gonna, you know, pedal to the metal. Uh, as you guys saw my physique update, weighed in at 169.2 this morning and I know that tomorrow we're gonna have a new low weigh in. I just got a great feeling about it and you're gonna have to stay tuned to the next video for that but I just want to share with you guys um, a little bit of of my experience and how I'm feeling right now and just vlog this great feeling um, I know you all have experienced that if you guys are fitness uh, enthusiast or go to the gym every day or you're working on your physique you know when you have a good workout and when things just fall into place so um, uh, this is gonna conclude this video I think this is episode 17 and it's 727 now I need I need to get going I have some ground turkey that I need to buy and prep for tomorrow and we'll see what we weigh in but I want to thank you all for tuning in to this video make sure you guys check out all the links in the description box for performance nutrition uh, ANS supplements uh, all my social media Instagram Facebook Twitter it's all there in the description box also the mister organization which I am the male model spokesperson uh, for them and I'm just so thankful for everybody who has supported me throughout this entire journey, throughout my entire career, who believes in me. And um, it's a few people, but I'm definitely thankful that I have them in my corner and that I can always, always go to them if I need help. So you know who you are. And I just wanna thank you guys uh, for being there for me. So without further ado, <laughs> CS is gonna check out CS Fitness. I wanna thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like this video and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next clip.